will be thy name, thy kingdom come. Thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses. As we forgive those who trespass against us, but lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from all evil. For thy is the kingdom, the power, and the glory forever and ever. Amen. Thank you, King of Glory, for answered prayer. Thank you, Lord God, because I know this day is blessed. Be amongst us all in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen. That was beautiful. Mm. Just like you. Mm -hmm. <sighs> oh, thank you, right. baby. So I hope you have a great day today. Mm -hmm. Yeah? You too, my love. <laughs> and I'm going to help you uh, take your stuff to, to the shop before I go to the site. Oh, thank you. Of course. Thank you, baby. Mm. Alright. Okay. <sighs> you ready to head out now? Yes, yes. Okay. I'll see you later at home. Sure. Love you. Alright. You didn't say you love me. I love you more. <laughs> love you more. <laughs> Bye.
I'm good, sir. I'm good, sir. How are you? How are you? Okay, what's that, sir? Okay, no problem, sir. This one to 200. This one 100 naira. How did it come cost like this now? At least I don't see him now. You don't see the country every day. Give me 100 naira. Ah, you don't do you? Hey, hey. I'm only 100 naira. I'm not going to walk. Thank you. Come back again. Eh? My water bell is sweet. Too. Thank you. Thank you. Bye, Anna. Thank you. Okay, bye-bye. Hey. hey, my love. How are you doing? This one that you came under this hot sun, is everything okay? Everything is good, but I just, I need your help with something. Okay, so Mr. Perfect called me, right? And he said that he was supposed to snap somebody today. He had a client, right? But he had to travel, he forgot, right? So the client called him today and said that she's ready for the photo shoot. So he called me and he said that she go to his office, pick up his camera and go do the shoot. Which is great, right? But uh, the address is, uh, he sent me. For the photo shoots, it's fine. I can't track it. So get me so I, I need how much? Do you need? Like one k. One k. Yeah. Okay. Thank you so much. I'm happy for you. Guys. I really, really appreciate. It. Come here. All right. Absolutely. Okay. Good luck. All the best. This man at the gate, the same photographer, and has an appointment with him. Mm, yeah, yeah. Bring him in. Good afternoon. You must be Miss um, Tyra. Yes, I am. And you are not Mr. Perfect. Um, I'm here for your photo shoot. Are you kidding me? <laughs> are you serious? No, no, no. Yeah. No. Uh, yeah. Mr. Perfect. I contracted you and paid you for my photo shoot. And we had this day booked for this photo shoot. Like, I kept my own side of the bargain. So, why do you want to make me look like a fool? Look, this will only make us regretting why we ever met each other. So please, come and do the job I paid you for. Good day. Um, young man, I do not have any business with you, so you can leave now. No, no, I mean, I'm a good photographer. Just give me a chance, okay? I, I promise you I'll do a good job. I'm actually good at this. I said I do not have any business with you. Please leave. Please, please. This business means a lot to me, okay? Just give me 10 minutes, okay? I'll set up real quick. Just 10 minutes, okay? If you don't like my handwork, I'll go. Um, please what? shut the door after you. I said leave already! God!
You have 20 minutes. Convince me. Beautiful. Great. That's very nice. Very beautiful. Ooh. Okay. Um, do you mind sitting here? Okay. Let me move this. Watch out for the please. Yeah. Sorry, 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 sorry. Just hold that phone. Hold that phone. One more. I'm sorry. You like it. Sorry, what were you gonna say? Um, can I see what you Sure, have? of course. Of course. So, um okay. Um to scroll is this to scroll, but you move it this way. Okay. okay. Yes, exactly. My God, this is beautiful. Yeah, it's... I must say that I'm impressed. Thank you. I mean, <laughs> I love the angles. Thank I love you. the creativity in the shots. Thank you. This is you. actually a very beautiful picture. It looks really nice. <laughs> you know, when the first thing you're taking pictures of is beautiful, it makes it easy. So, yeah. Thank you. No, it's true. You're welcome. This is so cute. Yeah, and look at that. Look at your leg <laughs> with the shoes and everything. Thank you so much. No, you're, you're welcome. Um, tell me, how long have you been a photographer? I've been, I've been taking pictures for a while now. Oh, really? Yes. Hmm. You're really doing a good job. Thank you. Thank you. Um, just leave for a minute to be back. Okay, okay yeah. let me. I'm done. All right. Okay. I already loved everything I've seen. I'm done. You're satisfied with it? Yeah, okay. Sure, All right. Thank you. I'll just pack up then. Okay. All right. Here is your transport fare. Uh, ma. Hmm? This. This is 5,000. Is it not too much? Too much? After all the stress, <laughs> it's not too much. Okay. You did very well, oh, thank you. Thank you, ma. Thank um, you. What about my pictures? When will we be out? Uh, okay, well, that is uh, Mr. Perfect. We'll get back to you on, on that. All right. All right. Thank you, Ma. Thank you. Okay. All right. Okay, have a great day. Huh? Thank you so much. All right. Yeah. Transport. Yes, you know, I gave her the best shots I could give her and she blessed me with 5,000, so I'm very happy. Babe, I am so happy for you. Your dedication to photography is gradually paying off. You know, it's uh, it's called dignity in labor and uh, a spice of grace, you know? Grace is very important. Babe, you know what? I want to cook for you today. A delicious meal. Very delicious. Eh? Okay. Hey, really? Yeah. Yes, um, I just need to drop this stuff back at Mr. Perfect's place and 
I go to the market, pick out the best ingredients for you, and when you come home, I'll shock you. All right, babe. Thank you so much. Well, it's easy to shock. First of all, thank you so all right. much. The container can easily be rebranded. <laughs> the container can easily be rebranded. <laughs> Caponde call you. My friend, come off my room. I say Caponde call you, you the fun galadema. Wait till they worry you. Calm down now. I say clear my bro. I don't want to fight you. Wait. Not off my soul. Zoe can get better water on this city. Hello. Hello. I they call you. Where you go? Calm get down out now. of my way. I say Caponde call you. My friend, come off my. I said I want to call you. Where you the phone call? I hey, hand down. I swear to God. Really, Kekke, but the Lord only see you. Submit your answer soon. Time over. Please. No, 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 no. Please, 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 please. It's not my own. It's not my own. It's not my own. It's not my own. Please, 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 please. Please, I'm begging you. I'm begging you. Please, please. It's not my own. Hello. If it's my, no, no. Please, please. It's not my own. It's not my own. Yeah. If it's my own, I can give you, I swear. Yeah, please, please, yeah, please, 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 please. No, 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 it's not my own. It's not my own. Is this now? Eh? How do we go about this situation now? I have no idea. I don't know. I don't know. That's what I've been thinking since this thing happened. Why would this kind of thing happen? I don't know what. I don't know what to do. I, I don't know. I don't know. Hi. Hi. And you won't believe you. Hi. Deep, oh, baby. We have to call Mr. Perfect as soon as possible and tell him what happened. Mr. Perfect. <laughs> Officer, get him out of my no, 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 no. Please, please. I'm telling you the truth. They, they, they stole it from me. I don't point. care what you went through. They had a gun. If you were swindled or robbed. Sir, please. 
All I'm talking about right here is my camera. I want back my camera or you get me back my money. Uh, Mr. Uh, Perfect. Uh, uh, Mr. Perfect. Just calm down now. Yeah? I've known Jason for quite some time now and he's not a liar nor a thief. Exactly. We can find some better ways to resolve yes, this matter. Sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Like for real, young man, you had better mind your business and just speak for yourself. Yeah? I love it when people don't try it into my business. This is my business. You had better keep up. I want my money back on my camera. Yes, or do you want to pay for the camera? Officer! Sir. No, no, no. Get him out of my sir. Please, 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 please. I'm begging you. There is a please, I'm telling you. It was an accident. Don't do yes. it. Hey, hey, hey. Please, Did I sir. just hear you talk about accident? Yes, it was an accident. It was, sir. It was an accident. Look at the size and the height of a man who claimed he was wrong. They had a gun, sir. They had a With gun. With a shot up. Sorry, sir. <sighs> Listen, I'm used to people hiding my camera and telling me they were robbed. That's not what happened, sir. Right now, I want back my camera. Not anymore. So I'm telling you, okay. I will never do that. Officer, sir. take him away. Hey, sir, 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 wait, sir, now, wait, now, now, be coming down now. now. This is your fellow man. Wait till they, wait till they saw. This is our country too. And that's more than you call police. Nah, no, don't, no, nah, don't tell me to come down. No, no. What is this man feeling like? Did they tell you say they robbed the guy? They, they had a speak. Yummy, yummy, yummy. Nah, eh, now. Young man, huh? calm down and let the police do their job. Quick, which police? I did not sell your camera, sir. Take him away! I swear to God, I did not look like this. Not like this, so. I know what you say. Now, what did I do you? It's our country. Yeah, Mr. Perfect. How are you? Yes, it's been days since I took a picture with your guy and he said you were going to deliver it to me. But I've not heard anything since then. Why? Um, what has delivering the pictures got to do with you coming to my house to see me? Okay, I am at home. Alright, I'll be waiting. I'm sorry, Mother. It wasn't my intention to disappoint you. When you told me about the photo shoot, I was pretty busy as at that time. I had intention to pay it down. I forgot. That was why the date clashed. I'm very sorry. I mean no disrespect. It's okay, no problem. Your guy delivered. So where are my pictures? Madam, that's why I'm here now. Jason called me after the photo shoot and told me he was right. My camera? All my pictures in the camera, they are all gone. We lost everything. What are you talking about? I don't understand. That was what he told me. He said he was robbed. But then I don't believe him wrong bit. As we speak, he's in the police net. By the time they touch on him for one week, he will tell the truth. <laughs> I'm so sorry about what happened. It's okay. But why did you get him arrested? Do you think he's lying? He's obviously lying, madam. Yes, he's lying. Well, I don't know him that much, but I do not think he'll be telling lies. Madam, listen to me. You don't know these guys one bit. They can fabricate stories to suit their devilish arts. My boys have done this, this to me several times. When I hardly even realized the kind of game they played on my back. But right now, my eyes. Don't 
and shall finish. I will pay for the camera. Are you for real? Um, take me to the police station where he is so I can have him released. What, am I serious? Of course I am serious. That's alright. You already have my duties with you. You effect my transfer, I get the money, and then I can take you to the police station. So you can tired of coming on why I'm trying to have someone complain about my I don't know. I knew all that thing cost me before I was able to get it. It took me virtually every drop of blood in my vein. So how much is the camera? Thank you. Thank you, ma'am. Um, sorry I didn't tell you that we were coming. I should have, I should have no, 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 no. It's fine. It's okay. Yeah. Um, well, uh, this is uh, Nelly. She's my, she's my girlfriend. Yes. <laughs> and uh, we just came to say thank you so very much for your help. You know, we really appreciate this and we're not taking it for granted. Thank you. Thank oh, you. yes. Um, thank you so much, madam. Like, seriously, I had no idea people with your kind of heart still exist. Like, what would we have done if you hadn't come through for us? Thank you so much, madam. God bless you. Yes, God bless you. It's, it's okay. It's fine. I'm so happy I was able to help. It's okay. It's okay. Thank you so much. Thank you. You did a lot. No, it's, it's okay. Um, so, you said that you guys don't want anything no, ever? No, 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 no. We're good. We're good. We just came to say thank you. Oh, we, we really appreciate it. It's okay. So, yeah. she's your girlfriend? She is. Yes, I am. <laughs> oh, nice. She's actually pretty. Abby? Thank you. You are too. And your house is beautiful. <laughs> oh, wow. It's a beautiful house. Thank you. Thank you. Do you love him? I understand. But this guy is in love with someone else. That's why I'm handicapped. Girlfriend, let for me. I'll say you let this guy be. Forget about him. He's not meant for you. Okay. This is the biggest challenge I'm facing now. Because the more I try to get him out of my mind, the more I see myself thinking about him. Ah, I'm so confused. You don't need to be confused, right? I just want you to have this at the back of your mind. That it's needless not to ruin a feeling that can never be. <laughs> Look for something else to distract yourself. And I believe gradually you will forget about this guy. Alright? But... But I'm so engulfed. <laughs> you are so engulfed? <laughs> what? <gasps> My girlfriend that I know does not have any time for any guy, <laughs> let alone being engulfed. Ah, love struggle. Okay. <laughs> 
Okay, fine. Uh, are you mocking me now? <gasps> really? No, okay. no, 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 no. Then why are you laughing? Look, okay. You should leave now. <laughs> leave my house. I am not going anywhere. I hate you. <laughs> I hate you. <laughs> okay. You're laughing at me. <laughs> In golf, indeed. You're not serious. <laughs> okay, now give me my drink. That's over. <laughs> Should we toast to that? My dear, initially, we thought the guy was all these guys that likes. Everything on that skirt. So the girl is here to go for the money now. Mm. Ah, it's now you, Nko. Little did she know that the guy was serious. Lo and behold, proposed. Ha! You know the most amazing thing? They are getting married next week. Are you serious? Hey, <laughs> Madu. That was <laughs> why my baby decided to resign and go and enjoy herself. My sister is now you, Nko. Naive. So I said, let me come and tell you. That position is vacant. Are you sure you are not interested? Eh? <laughs> Which kind of question be that? Babe, I am very interested. Yeah. You know I do not make enough money from this place mm. now. Oh, I need a job. Oh. You do. I do. You do. See what I will do, eh? I will take you to my manager. Yes. 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 Hey. Hey. Once I take you there. Ah, Lizzie, you be a better person. Thank you so much. Ah, my girl, <laughs> my thank you. Ah, 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 this is thank you. you. I knew you when you were at Metrics. You used to be all this uh, <laughs> baby slahot. Now look my at you, sister. fruit. You fruit. <laughs> oh, you don't do. Me. It's okay. My sister, what I cannot do does not exist. That's so. Yes, you like to show yourself. No, no. <laughs> <laughs> Funny. Um, looking into your eyes, I can see a thousand and one thoughts running through your mind. I've been thinking a whole lot about you. The first time we met, I felt a spark, a spark inside of me. And um, a day without you is, a day without you seems like hell. I even see you in my dreams. A day without you seems like hell. I know this is so strange because it's happening so fast. But I know what I feel is real. I... I love you. I love you so much, Jason. I know, but I, I, I can't give us a chance, okay? Because I'm in love with someone else. Yeah, I'm, I'm aware of that. and But <laughs> this is so strange that even as my heart keeps telling me that we can never have anything together, my mind, I mean, I, I just can't get you out of my mind. 
I don't know. I'm I'm just so confused. So Nelly, what happened? Nothing. What do you mean by nothing? Why did you punch my boss? Can you imagine? Can you imagine that that useless, shameless he goat wanted to have sex with me because he wants to employ me? Can you imagine that, Lizzie? And that punch, eh? That punch was just to remind him that it is not every girl he sees that is cheap or needs money. And each man. So you punched a multi-millionaire just because he, he asked for sex. Eh? It does not mean anything to you. Seriously, that doesn't mean anything to you. Oh my dear, it means a lot to me. Baby girl, I have a boyfriend and I will never cheat on him. You are useless. You are very stupid. Do you know what I did to get you that job? A job that pays 120,000 naira a month. Nelly! You're sitting down here telling me of your stupid, wretched liability. You are mad. Lizzie, you are a very stupid human being. If you open your useless mouth and insult my boyfriend again, try it. You are sick. You are sick upstairs because I don't know what that 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 wretched thing has done to you. I don't know what he gave you. Somebody you cloot, you feed, you even sleeps under your roof. You rejected a job for a liability, a wretched liability. A boy that I don't even know where you got him from. Someone that has no sense. Are you not stupid? Are you not stupid enough that that boy is talking? Stop wait, what's going on? Stop crying now so I can hear you. What's going on? Why are you crying? Jesus Christ. Where is she? Where is she? Where, where, where is she now? Okay. Okay, I'm coming. I'm coming. Uh, Vomiting blood. I know, I know. She, she has peptic ulcer and it's very, very bad now. My sister rushed us to the hospital and the doctor was saying that we have to deposit 270,000 before he can even start treatment. Two. Ah, that's a huge amount of money. I know. How can you say before he even oh. touches her, we have to pay 270,000? <sighs> Where am I? Hey, are we going to get that kind of money? I have no idea. I have no idea. I have no idea. I don't know. 
Hey. 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 The only money I have saved in my account is just 29,000 naira. But I think we can just take that to the doctor now, give it to him so he can commence treatment. Don't you think so? How much do you say? 29,000 naira now. Hmm. Oh, okay. Let him in. Oh. Yeah. Good afternoon, ma'am. Hi. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Please, I am not ma'am. My name is Tyra. Sorry. Um, yes, it's please. How are you doing? Um, you look worried and stressed. I hope all is well. All is not well. If I'm being honest, my mother has Alzheimer's. It's a very bad kind. Oh. She's in the hospital now. The doctor said I have to pay 270000 before he starts treating her. And I don't have any money. I don't have any money at all. Please, can you help me? Please, I, I, I would really, really, really appreciate it if you could please help me. Yes, yes, yes. I, I can help you, okay? Um, you just need to calm down. Um, I'll go up and change to something else and then we can go see her. Thank right? you. Thank you so I'll be back much. Just God now. bless you. No, Thank it's you. Fine. I'll be back shortly. Okay. All right. I'll be waiting. Thank you. Tyra? How did she know what's happening? Hmm. Okay, oh. no problem. Tell her thank you. May God bless her. Call you later. Bye. Tyra. Jason and Tyra. <sighs> this had better not be what I am thinking. Baby. So, what do you want to eat? Anything you want to eat? I'll make it happen. At least I'll try. I'll try my best. I am not hungry. Hey, why are you, why are you being all moody now? You've been moody since I came back. What's going on? Babe, talk to me. Huh? I know there's something wrong, okay? But don't you think talking to me about it will help sort this out? Have we started keeping secrets from each other? Huh? We're keeping secrets from me. Why are you looking at me like that? Yeah, I'm fine.
You're not fine. I know when you're fine, you're not. You are your fine as in beautiful, but come, babe, stop, 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 stop. Babe. Hello, Tyra. How are you doing? Yeah, no, I'm fine. I'm fine. I'm fine. My day was good. My day was good. My mother. Thank you for asking. She's doing much better right now. You know, thank you so much for everything. You know. No, yeah, yeah, yeah. I have. Um, what did I? Plantain porridge. Yes, well, plantain porridge it was nice as well. Um, you? Oh, nice, 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 nice. Um, oh, really? What time? Okay, yeah, yeah. yeah. I'll see you. I'll see you tomorrow. I'll come over to your place. Sure. Um, okay. All right then. So good night and uh, take care. Okay. Are you serious? <laughs> no, 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 we can talk a little bit more. Are you serious? I, I did not expect that. That's what, that's what you said Seven thousand. What? <laughs> Thank you. Thank you so much, Sarah. Thank you so very much. I really appreciate this. Thank you so much. Okay. I didn't expect this. You are a talented photographer, and I thought getting you a good camera and setting up a decent photo studio for you will help actualize your dreams. So, are you serious? You're really good at this and you should earn a living from it. Thank you so much. I mean, what would I do in life without you? I, you've done a lot for me, you know, but this is massive. Thank you so much. Nothing is too much to give to someone you love. Thank you so much for coming. I, I didn't even know you would show up. Thank you so much. Um, Lizzie, I beg you. I, I called you here because I went to your house two times. I, I did not see you there. I'm sorry about what happened to your daddy. Eh? Forgive me, please. I, I promise you, it was not intentional. You know I cannot intentionally hurt you. Eh, I don't know what came over me. I beg, forgive me. Please. You know I'm forgiving you. I'm forgiving you because of old time six. For old time. Friendship. Hmm? One person holds friendship. And that person is me. Why are you they talk like this now? Yeah. If you had killed me in your house, what would I have told you? Uh, what would I tell them? Uh, no vex. No vex for me, I beg. I am so sorry. Eh? My friendship. My friend you be oh. If you throw away me now, who go pick me up? I beg, no vex. Eh? I'm so sorry. Eh? <laughs> yeah. apple, apple for you. I know you like apple. Eh? <laughs> it's not that I want anything, you know. eh? it's because you asked eh? and you are insisting. Oh, yeah, what do you uh -huh. want? Just um, put two apples, this okay. big one. Okay. Put this one, one. 
then put this one like put this one four put uh -huh. this one two then you can add like just two cucumber and i'm good finish you can also give me that big one if you want to add it you can add it hey. yes please carry the show you asked Send the whole show you asked i was on my own you asked me no you won't carry my show but you see me because i'm gonna forgive me you asked <laughs> Yeah, look, okay, look, make her, make her just put up Jason. I went to Tyra's place. Remember I told you I was going there? Uh, I'm sorry I'm coming back late. But there's good news, okay? Guess what's in here? <laughs> she got me a camera. She got me D7000. Can you imagine? Babe, this is a really nice camera. She said she's going to set up a studio for me, like a photo studio. She's going to do all that. Check out the camera. It's really nice. Like Anybody that knows about cameras knows about this. It's really nice. Um, it's the D7000.
Cucumber is beautiful. I called you throughout yesterday and you did not take your calls. Why? Because we were calling at a very, very wrong time. I don't understand. It's not hard to understand, okay? I'm in love with another woman and I live with her, okay? So you calling me all the time, it's making her feel uncomfortable. She thinks I'm cheating on her now. So, what are you insinuating? Just give me some space, okay? Just space. So, you think it's that easy? You're not in my shoes, so you do not understand what I'm going through. I hate myself knowing too well that I can't get away from your shackles. But you don't even understand. Probably, you don't know what I'm going through because you have no feelings for me. I'd be lying if I said I didn't have feelings for you. But it's not just about us, okay? It's not just about you or me. I mean, there are other people. They've been there since the beginning, okay? It would be selfish not to think about the effects of our actions on, 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 on people, especially our loved ones. Just, just give us some space. Sorry. It's difficult, but I have to do what's right. Since when did you start drinking? <laughs> What's this about? Why are you come why are you crying? Huh? Or why are you drinking? This come on, babe. Well, sometimes we embrace our enemies to shield us from our friends. What? What does that mean? Babe, stop drinking that. That's it's your drinking is straight. What are you doing? You're going to have a crazy hangover tomorrow. What does that mean? Do your, your enemies, friends? What are you talking about? Can I ask you a question? What 
Babe, stop drinking. What are you doing? That <laughs> You're hurting your liver. You're not used to this and you're drinking it straight from the <laughs> bottle. When you when your enemy gives you the kind of solace that your friends deny you, what do you do? What do you do? You do, you do? You're talking in riddles. I don't understand what you're talking about, babe. Stop. Stop doing <laughs> Ow! Don't touch me. Don't touch me. You you touch me, I will kill you. Why are you talking in riddles? It doesn't make sense. I mean, babe, look at me. Look at me. <laughs> What's this pain I see in your eyes? Why'd you look like this? Betrayer. Betrayer hurts like hell. And the most painful part of betrayal is when it comes from when it comes from someone you trust, someone who was supposed to protect you, the person who is supposed to be there for you, when they betray you, it hurts like hell. Stop. Babe, stop, 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 stop. You're drooling. Come on, babe. Just don't touch me! Leave me, leave me alone! Get out of my room! <laughs> to get out. Just get out of my get out of my room. I said get out! Get out! Simple English! <laughs> this, this is my friend. This is what gives me peace. <laughs> <laughs> Nelly, are you sure you're not overreacting? <laughs> Lizzie, I can be anything but certainly not stupid. I know the games Jason and Tyra are playing. I am not a child. <laughs> but they have no idea who they are dealing with. I think you should calculate your steps. Not everything is at its seems. Lizzie, I spent time and energy. I invested everything in this man and I will not lose him because I am trying to make calculated steps. I will not do that. Do you understand? And sometimes you have to scatter before you build. <sighs> Nelly, I think you should tone down on your temper. Tone it down. Tone it down. Remember what it has cost you. Remember what it has cost you. Yes. What do you mean by that? You know what I mean. You know exactly what I mean. <sighs> Nelly, you destroyed a wonderful job you had with Matrix Energy because of your temper. This same temper made you react and you lost your job. A big company that got you this, this wonderful place. How you destroyed everything and lost your job because of this temper. Or, 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 or should I even say, the man you punched. A man that was trying to link you up for a job. Nelly. Please, please, I do not want to talk about all of those things, please. We will talk about it. Yes, we will. You nearly killed me in your house. You nearly choked me to death. Uh, I've said sorry and I've apologized. You know you have, but you still need to tone down. You still need to calm down. Look at 
at you. A beautiful, hard-working young lady working in a, in, a, in a wonderful company. All of a sudden, because of this temper, you're selling fruit. Ah! You're selling fruit, Nelly. Think now. Think now. Think. Nelly. A wise woman builds her home. A foolish one scatters it. Think. Think, please. Hey babe, how are you doing? Um, my friend wants you to do her birthday shoot, so she chose my house as her location. And um, next tomorrow is the date. I'll be expecting you next tomorrow and I can't wait to see you because I've missed you so much. Okay? Why are you silent on me? Babe? Hello? I just called you now, right? until you came into our lives and tried to destroy everything that took me years and lots of sacrifices to build. You lost me. Oh, shut it! Don't you dare act dumb! You know what the hell I am talking about? Oh, you think I don't know the dirty games you tried to play with Jason? Huh? But get this thing clear. I spent years with plenty of sacrifices to just sit and watch you come into our lives and destroy everything I built. Do you understand? Okay. Um, isn't it obvious that you're torn for years in your so-called relationship you did nothing. Rather, it sets Jason back. It's a pity that some people find it very difficult to realize maybe a chapter in a man's life ends. My darling, your chapter in Jason's life and story is over. My coming into Jason's life has made his dreams come to reality. Please, I beg you, 
Do not shatter this game. <laughs> Okay, that didn't paint you, that didn't put you in a good light. And you know that. Hmm. I know your plans to leave me for her. But it will not work. Nelly, not even once has the thought of what you just accused me of crossed my mind. Not even for a second. <laughs> Jason. You must think I am a fool. That's not what I'm saying, okay? That is far from what I'm saying. I'm just saying that your assumptions are wrong. It's wrong. Well, we shall see about that. Just know that I have my eyes on both of you. Times women can make a mountain out of a, an ant hill. I mean, what's the big deal? I don't understand it. Why are you fighting your shadow? Eh? I don't understand where her insecurity is coming from. It doesn't make sense to me. Mm. I agree with you 100%, okay? But then, to be honest with ourselves, we've got to be sincere. You've been with this girl for two years, or should I say the other way around? You know what I mean? But then, this has not happened. So, are you trying to tell me that you've not run some package with this other girl? See, what matters is what's in a person's heart. That's what matters. Not the mistakes, you know, that we've made in the past when we were weak for a moment. It's what's in your heart that matters, you know? I mean, both of them have shown me love. But the truth is, I've given my undivided love to Nelly and it's going to remain that way. Oh, you, you're correct. Huh? But do you constantly remind her that you love her, like, on a daily? Do I have, I mean, so she's trying to say she doesn't know what the man she's about to marry is capable of? <laughs> Or she's trying to say that Tyra is the only rich woman that stepped up to me. Is that what she thinks? Because she'll be wrong if that's what she thinks. What about security of love? They need assurances. Yeah, but without trust, you can't have security of love. Nothing survives a heart full of jealousy. Nothing. Okay, and she needs to understand that. It's okay. I don't know why she'll be making a big deal out of nothing. Calm down, man. I mean, she's a woman. Calm down. Ah. Stay, stay, maintain the position. I mean, okay, you can let go of your leg. Yeah, do you mind just facing me straight on? Right. Yes, okay. Hold on, let me uh, let me get this. Great, hold on, hold that pose, hold it. Uh, hold on, great. All right, turn this way for me. No, no, the other way, the other way. Uh, I'm sorry, back, back this way. Just look this way. Beautiful. With a nice smile on your face. 
Beautiful. That's nice. That's nice. Hold that pose. Hold it. That's cool. That's beautiful. That's beautiful. That's beautiful. Okay. Well, do you mind just sitting on the arm of this of this chair, right here? All right. Yes. Yes. Okay. Okay. This is nice. She has a beautiful smile. <laughs> You guys are in the same WhatsApp group. <laughs> okay, okay. Um, yes, yes, do that, do that, do that. Nice, do it again, do something. Do something, anything. Yes, beautiful. That's nice. That's nice. I like that smile. It's genuine. Yes. Um, babe, can I see the picture? Want to take a look? Yes. Uh, oh my god, this is beautiful. That's nice. These pictures are really beautiful. Okay, I told you, you need to come and see this. <laughs> they are so nice. So, and the outfit. This, this, is this the photo shoot you told me you were coming for, Jason? Huh? Calm down. You just go. We'll talk about this right now. We'll just go. I should go. I should just go. Calm down. And you, I warned you. I told you to stay away from my man. But you would not listen. Is she okay? Oh, talk to me! What are you doing? Oh my what god. What are you doing? What are you doing? Jason? Jason? Okay. Oh, sorry. What are you doing? Hey, 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 stop it, stop it, stop it. Stop it. You're going to break this camera. Kick You're out. going to break this camera. Stop. Stop. Jason? Stop. Let me go. Stop. I will punch you. Hey, no, let no, me go. Listen, stop. Let me go, Jason! Stop. What are you doing? What are you doing? What's wrong with. I'm so sorry. Tyra! I'm so sorry. Tyra, get out! Tyra, leave my house! Tyra, leave! It's not necessary. It's not leave! Necessary. Get out! to come to my house and harass me? Oh my god, she doesn't know the type of trouble she has gotten herself into. She has no idea because when I'm done with her, she will forever regret the action she took. What are you doing? Involving the police. So you want to get my girlfriend arrested? Come on. <laughs> really? That's all you can say? All you care about is her. Okay. Assuming she injured me, or maybe done something even worse, is this what you'll be saying? See, okay, I care about you as well. It's just that she has my love, right? I mean, okay, just in all honesty, if you were in her shoes, wouldn't you have done the same thing? Or even worse, if you saw me in a compromising situation with another woman? Just think about it, man. Yes. She distracted my photo shoot. But I would suggest calling the police on her. But I would rather advise you, Tara, to stay away from Jason. And you, Jason, you have to go home and straight it things with her. What's good? Uh, I'll see you ladies later. I'm sorry about this. Tyra, I can't believe that is the type of woman you are messing with her man. <sighs> she will kill you. It's better you kill every feeling you have for this Jason of a guy before it lands you in trouble. It's so easy for you to say. You don't have a boyfriend. You don't have a lover. So how would you understand stuff like this? Yes. I don't have a boyfriend, but at least I don't have someone trying to break my head. Tara baby, please. Your safety is more important. I can't believe I got slapped in your house.
Nelly. 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 What's the meaning of this now? What's this about now? Why are you doing this kind of thing now? What's up now? Eh? What's this about now? What's the meaning of this? You know, this is not necessary now. Please open the door. Let me carry my bag inside. Open the door now. What's this about now? This, what's the meaning of this now? You must think I'm stupid, Jason. I look like a fool to you. Abby? Jason. I am tired. I am super tired of the lies, schemes and manipulations. Jason, I spent so many years of my life on you. I gave you all of my love, my sacrifices. Jason, I, I took you in two years ago after your rent expired. Do you remember you promised me true love and marriage? But what did I end up getting? You dished me garbage. Jason, I am done. I am done with everything. So just pack your things and get the hell out of my house. Yeah, come on, don't do this. Okay, you want to throw away everything we share? Everything based on, 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 on what? Mere speculation. Come on, babe, come on. It's not mad. No, really? Are you mad? Do I look stupid to you? Jason, I saw you. I caught you red-handed with that stupid girl. And here you are standing lying to my face. Trying to confuse me as, as though I don't know what I saw. You must be meant. Jason, please. Just pack your things and leave my house. I know we're angry right now, but let's all just calm down and think about this, okay? Let's go inside and talk about it. It's not what you think it is at all. I can promise you that right now. It's not what you think. Let's just go inside. It's not a good look now. This is outside now. Please, let's just go inside and talk. You and who? You and who, Jason? You can sort this out. It's you, not a big issue. You, you. Ah, please. Please, oh God, I then beg you. Get out of my house. You know me. I don't want to come out here and see you again. You know me. You know me, Jason. You see that, yeah? It happened exactly how I told you. She misunderstood everything. And by the time I got home, she myself was outside. Like, why? She was outside here. I don't understand why she was shouting. I don't, I don't know why she behaves like this. Eh? She just misunderstood everything and carried myself outside. What if somebody took it now? What if uh, something's missing? Jason, calm down. Huh? Uh, she, she was angry. Yes. But just... Okay. Maybe you should just let her cool off. And then you'd speak to her when she's in a better condition to listen to you. She doesn't look like she even wants to listen to me at all. The way she was talking to me. She almost fought me. She doesn't want to see me at all. I don't think she was, she was going to listen to anything I'm saying. You should have seen her outside here now shouting. I, we all know Nelly. I know Nelly. We know her temper. But relax, she will cool off. Okay? She's just angry. Listen. <laughs> My house is your house. We can stay together till she cools off. Thank you, bro. Come on, you don't have to do this. I don't know why she's doing this. It's not necessary now. This is not necessary. What was this? Are we creating drama? We know. You see how she was shouting outside? Just shouting, shouting, shouting. My stuff is outside on the floor. Why is all that drama necessary? Is that drama necessary now? You're talking as if I'm a new person in this situation. Nelly and her temper, we know. That's her, that's her only weakness, her mm. only undoing. I don't know about only, but it's a major one. It's a major one. <laughs> Calm down, man. Calm down. Nelly. Nelly, are you... 
<laughs> Nelly, if you're in there, please pick up the phone. Just, just open the door. I need. To... Nelly, it's me. Nelly. Please, just open. Please, please, please. I'm begging you, just open the door. Let's talk about this, okay? I know. I didn't see you go out now. Please, just open the door. Let's talk now. Please, I'm begging you. Please. Please. Nelly. Come on now. This is not. Please now. Okay, I know I hurt you, but it's not what you think. I promise you it's not what you think. Just give me a second, let me explain, please. I'm begging you, please. Nelly, please just open the door, please. Like someone died. Okay, 
Um, come, let's go inside. Food is ready. It's okay, bro. It's okay. Come on. Just let's. You, you have to eat. No matter what, okay? We'll find ways to resolve this. I honestly can't believe Nelly took this nonsense too far. I don't know what's going on. I mean, my heart is broken. I just feel inexplicable pain right now. I can't even imagine what's happening right now. I don't... God. I don't know. So what's your plan? What are you going to do now? I don't know. But one thing is for certain though. I'm not going to sit here and just in combination with your family. I mean, you've done so much for me. So much. You're saying, but we are not complaining. No, no, no. Listen, thank you. I really appreciate it. Man. Seriously, thank you. But I have to go. Please. No Take care, man. Um, hello, KK? Um, where are you guys now? I'm already dressed and waiting. Have you called the, the stupid dummy cable? Uh, just... Just get ready fast uh, so that we can go. Uh, Good afternoon. Yeah, Nelly. How are you? 
Harry, please. I'd like to see Jason. Which Jason? Come on, Nelly. Jason is not in my house. <laughs> but I, I thought he came to you yesterday. You thought well. Yes, he was actually in my house yesterday. Uh, but he was here waiting for you to come around, to calm down. Uh, but you never did. So he carried his bag and left. I don't even know where he went. Nelly. Um. Nelly, I understand how you feel. I've been meaning to tell you this uh, for some time now. You're a good girl. You're a beautiful girl. You're a nice person. And I know very well that you've been there for Jason. Yes, even he knows and he's very grateful. But your temper, your temper is your greatest undoing. For a beautiful girl, you, you have the temper of a thousand angry warriors. I mean, you get angry, you don't even mind breaking things, scattering everything you have worked so hard to build. That is you, Nelly. It's not nice. I know you guys had issues. I may not know what you were going through, but Jason told me everything. And I think maybe you overreacted. Maybe you misjudged him. Or maybe... All he wanted was a chance to explain things to you. You should even give him a chance for communication. You just judged him and it's not right. It's not right. Maybe you need to work on this. Okay? If I hear anything, I'll let you know. I've heard you. Heard you. Just that. And the same thing when I did talk now. I've heard you. You need to stop crying, please. Easy, <sighs> how? How can I stop crying after the disappointment he served me? How? to cry out your eyes. I don't even know what you were thinking when you chased him out of your house. But see, eh, you need to believe that what will be, will be. Please. I love you. 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 I
love Jesse. I know. God knows I love that guy. But I will not watch another woman come in between us. I will not do it. Yes, I am angry with him over what he did. But I do not have plans of leaving him. And anybody that wants to come in between us, ah, they will not love what I will do. Uh, 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 see, see. You need to take it easy. Eh? You need to calm down. Okay? It's your temper. It's getting too much, oh. You, 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 won't, you won't change this man away with this temper. Yeah? And I, I, I strongly, I strongly believe that you might need them. Yes, you will need them. So please take it easy. Calm down. Does it look to you like a bloody care? I don't care. Okay. One thing is certain though. I will not lose Jason. I will not lose my Jason. I, I, I will not lose him to any woman, especially not that. Tyra! I, I, yeah, 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 yeah. Nelly, Nelly, calm down. Calm down, okay? You will not lose him. Yes. In fact, you can't lose him. But you may not lose him to Tyra. But you may lose him to your temper. Yes. Because your greatest enemy may not be Tyra, but your temper. Okay. Um, please, I'm here to see Jason. And, um, who are you? Oh, I'm sorry, my bad. My name is Tyra. Oh, Tyra. Hmm. Um, well, Jason is not around. He had some issues, some problems with the girlfriend, and she threw him out. Oh no. This is bad. Um, do you know when he's coming back? I don't know when he's coming back. I don't know where he is, and I don't also know how he's doing. Thank you. Uh, bye bye. Bye. Bye.
some of these girls get hurt. You mean say you get hurt? Come to look for this guy. <laughs> you don't know Nelly. You don't know Nelly. <laughs> if Nelly Kolobi you. <laughs> Tara, can you please calm down? Please. I can't calm down. down. How do you expect me to calm down when that god forsaken woman threw him out of her house? How could she? Now she doesn't have him, neither do I. Tara, I understand. I understand how you feel. But you see, Jason is not a child. He can take proper care of himself. And maybe he decided to stay away from the two of you so he can think what next to do. Okay, okay, listen. What if he has fallen in the hands of bad people? Or maybe gotten into some kind of trouble? What will I do? He has not gotten into any trouble. Look, that young man is going through emotional trauma. And coming here will send a bad signal to the girlfriend. Who already suspects there is something going on between you two? Like I said, you have to ease your heart, okay? Calm down. I just, I just hope he's okay. I just he hope is. he's alright. He is. I can't even reach him. It's okay. Right? Calm down. Thank you. You'll be fine, alright? girl with big god big money you're throwing it around i don't know where he is i'm not lying to you Two hundred thousand naira hey 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 it's beginning to sound like an insult what do you mean by that why are you offering me money i'm just telling you i don't know where my friend is and you're you're offering me money don't insult me please i'm 
sorry. I'm sorry. I don't know where Jason is. And truly, his line is off. Just hold on, let me tell her how you are here. Are you mad? I said I want to see your mother your time. You want to hold on, let me tell her. this bloody gate. I said, oh, are you mad? Open this gate, let me enter inside. Hold on, let me tell her you are here. If you like say Chris, they worry you. If you like say you want me to you. Let her be. Better. 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 You. You disgusting daughter of Jezebel. Excuse me? You still have the guts to show up in my house? You must be popping champagne, eh? Celebrating because you think you now have my man. But let me tell you something. Do not rejoice quite soon because it is not over until it actually is. <laughs> what a stupid and desperate woman you are. What? To have left a good man like Jason for what? Mere assumptions? Now listen, miss. Jason is mine and will always be mine. Now get that into your little thick skull. So why don't you go in there, tell him to come outside so we can go home. <laughs> You're obviously mentally deranged. Are you mad? The last time you came rant and I let you be. But now if you dare me, I will make sure you rot in jail. Oh, I'm so scared. Get out of my house. Oh, of course I will leave your house. But let me tell you something and get this and get is very very clear not while I am alive will you have Jason I swear and I promise you it is over my dead body I will see you soon I can't open this gate now come up for here I can't open this bloody gate just hold it I, 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 now talk to me open, open this gate Imagine. If someone come and marry you and bam, 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 put in his house. Jason away from me after everything I have sacrificed. Ha. Okay. And who makes you think Jason is with her? What kind of silly question is that? Lizzie, I am not a child. That girl has snatched my man from me. And I promise, I promise I will make her life a living hell. Instead of you looking for your man, and sorting out things with him. You're going to fight the innocent girl, young lady. Young lady, focus on finding Jason and sort out things with him. There is nothing to sort out with Jason. I hate him. Oh, I detest Jason with so much passion. And I swear, I swear he will know no peace as long as he lives. <gasps> See the pain he caused me. He will experience the same level of pain, I swear. Whatever I'm talking about, you are too harsh. I don't bloody care. Now, 
Hello, Mr. Perfect. Um, I'm looking for Jason. Have you seen or heard from Jason lately? Okay, um, I'm looking for Jason. And I'll really appreciate it if you can share with me any useful information that would lead to his whereabouts.
off like that. I've been looking for you all over the place. Why did you do this? I'm sorry. Do you know what your absence has cost me? Please. Can we just talk? Please. I thought it was best I stayed away from both of you. So I moved to a part of town where I felt none of you could find me. But I guess there's no limits to the extent a loving heart will go in search of what it wants. Here I am with you again. When I went to your house, I saw your friend. And he told me that she threw you away. Yeah, well, I was with my friend for a while. While I was begging her, I was begging, but she didn't want to hear anything from me. She didn't pick up my calls. She didn't reply to my text messages, nothing. So I just I figured she, she was over us, you know, so I, I had to leave. She came here. She came here threatening fire and brimstone, saying that she can never watch you and I be together. My mom said she came to her place and uh, accused me of leaving her for you and said she would do something crazy if she sees us together. I mean, her level of jealousy and just how insecure she is, it's becoming very alarming, you know? Truth is, I love her. I love her, right? And I was ready to lay down everything and keep my promises to her, but just how jealous she is and how violent she can get and her general approach to the whole situation it just put me off you know i mean she didn't even come looking for me she did and while i was talking to her trying to reach out to her she didn't want to listen to me she didn't want to hear anything from me so i'm done i'm just moving on what do you mean you know how violent nelly can get she can get very violent I don't want anything to happen to you because of me. So I'm just, I'm going to have to move away and start a new, simpler life. But, but you, you don't have to do that. Please, don't try to stop me, okay? It's the best thing to do for all of us. It's cool. It's my decision and it's final. I mean, I don't even recognize you anymore. You've changed. And I don't want to make any decision that will make the situation even worse. I mean, you made threats to lives. You did that. It's better safe than sorry, so it's over between us. It's over. Jason, you can't, you can't say that. You can't say that, Jason, please. Look, I, I'm sorry. I, I promise you, everything I said was completely out of anger. I don't mean any of those things, please. I'm you sorry. Know, I I'm no, 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 no. Just stop, 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 stop. I cannot stop. do this. No, 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 no. Listen, listen. There's no time to explain. That time has gone, okay? We're in a different phase now, okay? So you don't need to explain anything. I've made my decision and it's final. Jason, it's me. I have to go. Okay. Take care of yourself. Jeez. that is in your best interest. But I made you a promise and I would love to fulfill it. Um, I'm 
I'm sure the money there will be enough to get you a good apartment and um, help you set up your photo studio. Thank you so much. I love you so much, Jason. Indeed, the heart knows what it wants. I've always wanted you. And now I have all of you. you know, people say you don't know what you have once you lose it. I think you don't know what you're missing once you experience it. You know, love should bring happiness and peace and all around security. My heart warms to you. I have no doubts or fears about the beautiful, beautiful memories we're going to create together. I love you so much and I promise to be your peace, your backbone, your love, your soccer. I promise to be your forever and everything. I love you, I love you so much, my big, big, big teddy bear. To the moon and back, I love you forever. I love only you, my beautiful time. I love you. I love you too. You said that like a million times. Because <laughs> it's true. Yes, it's true. 